model products, exclusive items, popular brands, on-time delivery, and outstanding customer service. And it is LLD. That's better. So obviously, if you go watch the first video, that was a month ago. Whatever we're doing is working. Okay. All right. 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 Oh, we're so close. We're so close to 160. We're so close. Hello. Eat my fingers for the internet. We are late. We are late. Bye bye, Baz. Nope, nope. You can't come. Baz! <laughs> you can't come. I'm sorry. I gotta go to the gym, Baz. No, 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 don't be, don't be like that, Baz. <laughs> don't, don't be. The gym is a mile away. I have eight minutes. Kind of wish I had a car. The air hurts my face. Why do I live somewhere where the air hurts my face? All right, we're gonna go, go. We're gonna go. I gotta go all the way the fuck over there. A fun fact, at Whole Foods, before I did YouTube full time, I worked there. I used to work at that Whole Foods. I used to stack vegetables. Stack fruit and vegetables. <laughs> fucking ramble. I'm a maniac. Somebody stop me. How did you get so photogenic? It's so easy to film you as you lick your nuts. Great. <laughs> ow! 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 ow. Oh. Bread. Bread. Meat. Steak. Chicken. This is actually lamb because I'm cultured as fuck. Milk. We get to talk about these things, okay? These things, I'm gonna make a nerdy analogy, okay? You don't need these things. These things are supplements. Have you ever played Pokemon? Pokemon. Oh, <gasps> Baz, that shit still works. That shit still works, Baz. This is how I played back in the day too. I was a very special child. Now in this game, there are things that you could find called HP up. Protein, iron, calcium, carbose. Carbose? <laughs> so what these things did, they would add a, a point or two to your stat of your attack, of your defense. All right, now here's the analogy. You've got yourself a level five Pikachu and you're like, man, I wish my Pikachu could beat up that Gyarados, okay? I wish my level five Pikachu could beat this, this level 55 Gyarados. And then you're like, oh, I'll give my little five Pikachu a uh, protein, and then I'll use tackle and you know, fuck that Gyarados right up. Wrong. These things are good for at the end of the road, at the end of your journey, you've done all your work, you've leveled up, and you want to just get Basil. Are you st straight up eating a carpet right now? They are not going to be super important to progress. This is 2017 Mighty Merch, which means that when January rolls around, this is all gonna be gone. I'm actually really excited. Really excited for these ones. They're gonna be really cool. I'm gonna get some of that cotton candy in my mouth, you know what I'm saying? It's so fucking cold. 9 p.m. I like to go get my exercise done in the middle of the day normally, but as an adult, you don't always get to do things you wanna do today. I was very busy working on the new merch, had lots of businessy type stuff. I had to get shit done regardless of what time it was. It's below freezing, it could snow at any minute. But you know what? I'm happy I'm out here and I mean that. And that's important. Being mighty is kind of like another way of saying X factor. They got that X factor focus on an end goal without being distracted by by nothing not no cold weather not no being tired not no being far away just making it work and accepting no other option
915. I'm getting 915. Just kidding, we're trying to gain weight. We're seven pounds up in a month, which is not bad when you're pushing through a change in your body, a plateau, something that it's not used to. It's gonna take some time. I'll be able to do 10 to 15 pounds by the beginning of January and be 170 by, oh, 170 of mass by the end of January for the big tournament to meet all you guys. <sighs> I gotta do it. I am putting some meat on, for sure. I am putting some meat on. Another gym tip while we're here and while I have the space to myself. See this? No, you don't. <laughs> These weights are here to work for you if you're looking to get into shape, build lots of muscle, uh, lose fat. These things are tools. Who cares if you're curling? Oh! Oh my god! Let me know if you enjoyed more stuff in the gym in these episodes, especially for next month. Got a lot of really great feedback on the last vlog. Are monthly updates good? Do you want more? Do you want me to do every couple weeks? I just figured you guys would want to see more of this. So it's the next day. It is the following day. We are back at the command center ready to see how much we've grown here. <laughs> Sporting last year's merch, the That's Mad Dad shirt. Some of you guys have that. What is going on with, the, with this shower hair? Doesn't matter. And I woke up this morning and it looks like the new shirts are ready. You can go over and get them at uh, Designed by Humans. I will put the link on the screen and in the description. On the front page of their website, they usually have discount codes. So please go look for one before you purchase. Just like last time, we're going for a 1,000 point death match. And last time, I got 587. So what I've been noticing over the last month is my desire to try new things and accept new challenges and step out of my comfort zone has escalated astronomically. And although I'm going to continue trying to improve at CSGO, and I will not stop until I reach my goal to get that 1000 point TDM game, I found myself playing less games. This is it. 587 points. Aki's. Ah! Oh, what's going on there? Whew. Two minutes. Nice. I don't have the bonus anymore, though. This kind of sucks. Nice. I knew my bullets, my spray was there. I knew it would be so. Here we go. Dude, right at the end. What a horrible game turned into actually a pretty decent comeback. Ten in a row. Make it 11. No, not the shotgun! <sighs> what do you do? Potential for some bonus. Alright, I should take mid control here. And then it puts me out in the middle of nowhere for the last 20 seconds. At least beat my last one. At least... Yes! Better! Better! 600! Better! Oh, I thought for sure I was gonna scrap this game because it was going so terribly and then, oh, I just pulled it back! The power! The power of just, oh, muscling through and ignoring every bad thing that happened prior. Oh, that felt good. My first month's game felt really good all the way through. I was feeling really good, but I got more points this time. Shit, man, we, we, we gotta go, we gotta go. We out. I feel like I spend a lot of days doing this. <laughs> Pinky's out. <laughs> so other challenges. I'm going outside of my comfort zone 
I have decided to play a different game with some of my time. Cover the price. What? Cover the price. The cool thing about this game is that it's all in your head. What I'm trying to say is that I'm stepping out of my comfort zone. This is highly considered something extremely nerdy, even by gamer standards. But you have to be a pretty responsible person to be in charge of the good experience that six or seven, I'm doing seven people. Running a game for seven people uh, in my Discord on Sundays at where I'm practicing how to DM. What's a DM? A dangle move, a, dang, a dingle mover. Dank memes. Dank memes. What does that mean? It means that you're the one that controls the entire adventure that six people have in their heads. And what skills have you developed? People skills. Communication skills. Emotional skills. Emotional maturity. Time management. I don't know. I just saw Critical Role one day and decided I'm going to learn how. I'm going to sit down and take all the things that I know about the people playing with me and I'm going to write a story. I think the whole point of this is me wanting new challenging experiences outside of my comfort zone, dealing with other people so that it can make every other thing I do, both on YouTube and in my life, better. Does your DM game have a theme tune? Yes. What is it? Sounds just like this. You know, initially in my head, I think this whole scene in my imagination, I came to the coffee shop alone. Not to be heckled by. <laughs> That's a D20. Alright. One D20 to see what the future holds. What does that mean? It could mean anything. Wait, what? Your book doesn't have an answer? <laughs>